When it comes to tuning an acoustic guitar, for years I've used one of these. This is a Daddario uh, micro headstock tuner. It clips on to the headstock of your guitar. And whenever you press this button to turn it on, you plug the string and it registers here on uh, the face of the tuner, the note. But I've seen a lot of people that have begun playing with these and so I wanted to try it out. This is a micro sound hole tuner. And so the difference here is that this tuner goes into the sound hole of your guitar. Uh, it's a bit more cumbersome to get down in there, but it's not that difficult. It attaches uh, with this little resistance bar right here into the sound hole. And whenever you turn it on, you can see uh, the sound, or you can see the note that registers on the face of the tune here. So I wanted to compare these two tuners and see is one better than the other. There's a price difference between these two that you can see here on the screen. Uh, but what I'm gonna do is I'm, uh, I'm using both of these tuners at the same time. For the first round of tuning, I'm using just my thumb to pluck the string, then I'll use a pick to pluck the string to see if there's any difference in reaction time here. And then at the end of the video, I'll let you know my thoughts between these two Daddario tuners. Generally, I think that both of these tuners do what they're supposed to do. I will say that over the years, I have noticed that the headstock tuner will have difficulty picking up the resonance of a string when that string is plucked with a pick, but that if you pluck with your thumb, it picks up the resonance more effectively. In terms of the price, it really isn't that big of a price differential. I think that the sound hole tuner costs like three or four dollars more. As far as the looks of these tuners, I think that I prefer the sound hole tuner. Aesthetically, it seems to have a smaller visual footprint than that of the headstock tuner. Uh, all around, again, I just said, I think that both tuners do essentially what they're supposed to do, though I do feel like the sound hole tuner maybe had a slightly quicker response time. And also, I noticed that whenever I was strumming a chord and then I would quickly hit a fretted note, I felt like the sound hole tuner picked up on the resonance of that fretted note more quickly than the headstock tuner. So basically, I think that my conclusion on these two tuners are that it comes down to essentially just which one of the two do you like the looks of more. So in the comments below, if you would, let me know, do you use one of these two Daddario tuners, the headstock tuner or the sound hole tuner? And then two, 
Could you tell a difference in the response time from the headstock tuner to the sound hold tuner in terms of when I was plucking the strings? 